bioradio is a wireless electrophysiological monitor for ECG, EMG, EEG, EOG, and a variety of transducers and sensors. BioCapture is integrated software that allows for real-time display and interaction with physiological data recorded and transmitted from the bioradio. BioCapture is designed for research applications and includes essential signal processing capabilities. The bioradio requires a Windows-based PC and an available USB port for charging, transferring data, and if needed, using the provided Bluetooth adapter. A PC's enabled internal Bluetooth can be used in lieu of the provided Bluetooth adapter. Each basic bioradio kit includes a convenient carrying case, a bi-radio data acquisition unit, an optional Bluetooth adapter, a USB charge cable, 10 snap electrode lead wires, a disposable supply kit that includes gauze, medical tape, conductive electrode cream, 90 cloth snap electrodes, skin prep, 200 alcohol wipes, and 100 cotton swabs, a quick start guide, and finally, biocapture software and the bioradio user's guide, of which are available from our website at www.glneurotech.com forward slash bioradio hyphen software. The bioradio needs to be fully charged before it can be used wirelessly. Simply plug the charge cable into an available USB port of a PC into the charge port of a bioradio. A full charge takes approximately 3 to 4 hours to complete. While charging, the bioradio can acquire data and perform other functions as normal. The battery icon on the bioradio will flash during charging. When the bioradio is fully charged, all of the battery's bars will flash. The BiRadio communicates wirelessly using Bluetooth connectivity. If your PC has Bluetooth, simply ensure that it is on. To check for an internal Bluetooth device, simply look for a Bluetooth icon in the system tray of your PC's operating system. If your PC does not have Bluetooth, simply use the included Bluetooth adapter. Plug it into any available USB port for automatic installation. BioCapture software can be downloaded from our website at www.geoneurotech.com forward slash bioradio hyphen software. Within the downloaded zip file is setup.exe. Simply double click on setup.exe for guided software installation. Each bioradio is labeled with a unique ID, called a unit ID. The unit ID is printed on the back of each bioradio. From BioCapture's menu bar, select Device followed by Select Device. Select your bioradio unit ID from the list of unit IDs and press Connect. The software and your bioradio are now wirelessly connected, and your bioradio is now ready to receive programming instructions from BioCapture software. The bioradio can be tailored to receive a variety of signals directly from a subject's body or from a sensor, such as a skin temperature probe or pulse oximeter. Before acquiring data, it is necessary to tailor or configure bioradio input channels accordingly. While wirelessly connected, press Device Config from the menu bar. From the Device Config window, you can configure the bioradio for either differential or single unit channels. Enable, name, and set the resolution for each enabled channel, and set the sampling rate for all enabled channels. When you are finished with configuration settings, press Config and the bioradio and the software's display plots will be configured according to those settings. With the bioradio connected and now programmed, you can begin to acquire and save data. Press the green Start Acquisition icon to start collecting data. And when ready, press the red Record button to record a file and to start saving data to that file. Pressing the blue Stop Acquisition icon stops both acquisition and saving data, if recording. For further help setting up the bioradio, please refer to the main bioradio product webpage at www.geoneurotech.com 
forward slash bioradio and press the support tab on the navigation bar. There you'll find the complete bioradio user guide, application specific quick notes, a video library including application driven webinars, and an online chat. You can also email support at geoneurotech.com or call with support questions.